Evening all, welcome back. So tonight we're going to bring you a video so you can check on your Fire Stick for malware and viruses. This has been requested by quite a lot of you for a remake of this, so I'm going to do it fresh. Plus, since the likes of Death Squid you now have to sign up for, although it's free, you have to sign up for to use, we can show you a way to use do this check for your malware and viruses without it. Do bear with me, I've got a eye infection at the moment, so I'm going to get myself through this as well as I can. So what we're going to do, when it comes to your Fire Sticks and sort of Android devices, you're not really going to get full-on viruses like you would a PC, but you get apps installed, and the apps would come with malware in them, or some form of tracking, or anything like that within. Um, so an apps will use your resources, and they are just known as unsafe. So what we need to do is check all your apps, and then I'll show you how to uninstall apps as well. All in one video. So we're going to install an app, which will help us check apps. Before we do that though, if you can, do remember, if you're brand new here, do hit that subscribe button. Check out the rest of the channel. We've got tons of videos all for your streaming content, whether it's streaming, whether it's movies, TV shows, whether it's features, whether it's tips, tricks, unboxing, downloads, the lot. Plus, if you're a regular watcher, do hit that share button and drop me some comments underneath, guys. I'm, videos are going to be hit and miss this week. I'm under the weather still. Bad eye now. Was ill last week. Not going to go into it. So... What we're going to install today, some of you I'm sure, if you're regular watchers, would have used it, but it's worth running this check quite regularly, is install Virus Total, okay? So this is Virus Total, I'm going to open it up now, I'm going to show you how to use it, then I will show you how to install it. So, mine's a little bit stretched, doesn't really matter, you just have to hit on scan, okay? You hit on scan and this will scan every single app on your device which you've installed, whether from official sources or unofficial sources. You can completely ignore this bit, okay? Just click OK. And what you will see is amongst your apps, you have green ticks down the side or red ticks, or possibly even an amber tick. Anything which is red, you need to remove. Similar to that, even ambers I look at removing as well. If they are green tick, they are safe to use. This is from Virus Total. You can look at Virus Total online, big website. They do lots of checking of apps. You can even drag your own apps in there to check them. So they've already had lots of scans and checks. On all of these and they're in your device so if you have anything which is a red let me know underneath some things do flag up with some detectives in them but they're safe to use anyway okay so even Disney Plus has one has one in there um, above my head you see it red there but the actual report says it's safe to use okay what you might find is some apps you have I might have them as green and you may have them as red what this means is sometimes they're modded versions, people put malware in them, then you download them from a dodgy website onto your device. This is why we recommend using official sources to download, or as official as they can be. So you either use your Amazon App Store, places like that, or come to people like myself, my website, which I'll show you in a minute, or you know all the other YouTubers in our genre, there's loads of us. Um, we all have good websites with apps that we test before we put them up there for you to download. So, if you are unlucky enough to have a red one in here, what you would need to do is remove it, okay? So to remove that app, you would go across to your applications in settings, go to applications, go to manage installed applications, and then you can find that app and remove it, okay? It's important to remove it, then go and find it somewhere else to install it, which is a safe version. So if you wanted to uninstall something, um, what don't I need on here? I don't know. And I'll give it that for now. So you click it and you just click on uninstall. You click uninstall, it will tell you how much storage you're getting back and you can uninstall the application in no times, okay? So that's all uninstalled. So what we're going to do now, I'm going to show you how to get this virus total installed on your device, then you can run it and check your own, okay? So if you're following through, I will slow down a little bit now for you. So to install this, we need to get an app called Downloader. Downloader is an app which allows us to install multiple apps from external sources outside of the Fire Stick. So go to your Find, click on Search, and in here type in Downloader, D-O-W, and you'll see Downloader underneath. Okay, Click that and get it installed. Get it installed, but don't open it yet. Once it's installed, go across to your Settings, go to My Fire TV, Developer options, turn on ADB debugging, and install unknown apps, it needs to be turned on for downloader, okay? Make sure it's turned on. At this point, you might, some of you might have an option just of install unknown apps, yes, no. Um, not the individual apps, so just turn it on. 
Then you need to find your downloader again. So you can search it again is the easiest way if you don't know how. Open it up and this time you can actually open it, okay? When you open it for your first time, when you open it for your first time, make sure you accept the permissions. If you do not accept the permissions, this is when you'll be commenting in a minute down, down underneath this video saying it's not working, it doesn't work, okay? Make sure you accept those permissions. If you forget, you might have to uninstall it, then reinstall it again and accept them. Right, in here then we're gonna to go to my website. On my website we can download this virus checker, which you can do it on your phone as well if you wanted to test your phone and check your apps on there if something's not working properly. So if you want to check the link, it's underneath in the description, top link, called docsquiffy.com forward slash downloads. But while you're in the downloader app, you can type 75726. You then click go, and that will redirect to my page. While you're waiting for this, remember this is a prime time to hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and drop me a lovely comment. And for me to go and clean my eye, probably, or oh, it stings today. It stings. So, once you're here, we're gonna scroll down. There's loads of other things here. Download streaming APKs, apps, and tools to cut the cord. So check them out. Keep scrolling down, and you will find it down here, okay? It'll be under Downloaders and Tools, and what you'll find is Virus Total. You click it, and you scroll down again, and there's a huge download button. If you get an error here, downloading, it means you haven't accepted the permissions, okay? Right. Then behind my head, let me move it. You then click on install. Then you click on done. You can then click delete because you don't need to keep this file because you've installed it now. And delete. And that's all installed for you, okay? So then back on your home screen, if you pop across to your applications, which is these three squares and the plus, my apps. You're looking for this symbol which I've got at the top here, um, the, like an E looking symbol within a blue. But yours will be near the bottom if you've freshly installed it, okay? So mine's at the top because I've moved it. Then you can open it up, run the scan, and you can find out if you've got any dodgy apps. If you have got any iffy ones, let me know underneath which ones they are. Any issues you're not sure about, let me know underneath. Quickly before you leave as well, of course, hitting that subscribe button is key. Also, if you want to support the channel, quick word from one of our partners, IP Vanish VPN is a company we work with. So if you're after a VPN, um, we work with them. So we get a small affiliation if you sign up. This is better than any memberships to us or Patreons or anything like that because you get a VPN and we get a little bit of commission, which helps us bring you great prizes, giveaways, plus helps us continue to do what we do. That's linked underneath. If you are after a VPN, that will work on all your devices link directly underneath for you. All my other socials are under there as well. All the links you will need is underneath. Brilliant. I'm out of here. I've been Doc Squiffy. This is the Doc Squiffy channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.